Welcome and thank you for joining me. My name is Sun Bob and we've been trying to play Robocraft and I have discovered the problem. The latest update and upgrade to Unity 5.3 caused a problem with my Steam connection since I'm running on Linux. Um, just so that people know, I run Linux Mint 17.2 and that was what was causing the problem. So, I want to thank Ock999 for posting a, a fix. And it's really very simple. If you have the same problem, if you have been opening up the new program and you're getting all sorts of rendering issues and crashes, um, go to your main page in Steam right click robocraft go to properties under general set launch options and type in dash force dash open gl click ok close it out and i think you will find that you are back in the game Is it going to make it? I'm initializing. And will I connect to the server? Yes, I did. I am connected to the server. And I just like to run this at 1600 by 900. And doesn't that look beautiful? That looks wonderful. And so let's take it into a quick TDM and might as well take take the intern just to make sure that it'll work well in gameplay. Let's see how it does. And we got in real fast too. That was nice. That was very nice. Yep, it's recording properly as well. Everything seems to be working the way I want it to. And we have a mega in here somewhere. I'll bet that's our mega. The battle for Hellion Crater has begun. And this is a hover, so let's see how the hover works. Now this is not a hover hybrid, it's just a plain old hover with nanos on it, which means I probably need to go find my Mega. I th forgot for a second that I was playing a healer. Enemy spotted. Come on. A jump in Enemy here. spotted. Enemy spotted. Yeah, they handled that well. 
spotted. healing. We didn't do much for a score, but we're back in the game, and that's the important part. Well, folks, that's really all I wanted to do was test to see if it was if we were able to play, and I play lousy, but it looks like we're okay. Maybe some micro freezes in there. But at least we didn't lock up and we were able to play the game. So it looks like we're back in business. Sounds good. All right. Well, I'm, this is just going to be a quick post to... But really, I wanted to put up that fix for any Linux users out there. Those of you who have abandoned Windows um, and use Linux, every once in a while we run into these problems. But looks like this is the fix so I thank you and go ahead and let me know your feedback and comments how what your experience is with the new upgrade to the new unity engine and as always do your fighting in the games but in your world I bid you peace bye bye <laughs>